Hey, it's time to talk about Chainsaw Man. Yay! I am definitely not inspired by this two amazing creator that made Chainsaw Man video literally weeks ago. I definitely am. Please do check out your channel. But yeah, I actually did just watch their video like just a few minutes ago. I was like, man, I'm kind of motivated to upload a video related to Chainsaw Man, but nothing really like... um kind of repeating their stuff talking about the production whatsoever obviously i am not getting into those things because well i'm pretty sure you guys are not that um interested but if you are please do check out sinchi or probably pretentious for all those sort of thing because but let's just talk about the analytic of the chainsaw man movie or how it will actually be because man i think it will be quite a record breaking movie Obviously, I'm not going to be talking straight out of nowhere because I did my research, obviously. I actually did not. Anyways, um, let's actually talk about the probability of Chainsaw Man movie, this crazy art, getting um quite a high-selling performance for its, like, what, first week, first two weeks of it getting released, like, in Japan because Chainsaw Man is quite a high profile manga in Japan and not only in Japan pretty much worldwide obviously I'm I don't think it actually reaches any type of Demon Slayer level unfortunately but obviously with this arc getting adapted into a literal movie one of the best Chainsaw Man arc and also the actual part where we actually is getting deep into Chainsaw Man with this thing being adapted into a movie obviously it's going to get more attraction right well hopefully Hopefully. Well, as you guys know, Chainsaw Man, the first season, doesn't really get that much of a traction. I mean, like, it did, but people kind of hate it because of those cinematic approach by Ryu Nakayama. But obviously, um, I, I actually don't want to talk more about it because it's just quite painful to see people hating on this cinematic approach by Ryu Nakayama. But obviously, people have their preferences, so I can't really give my comment on that. Obviously again uh, this is going to be the first time we'll be getting a movie for chainsaw man and now yes we got demon slayer megan train we got jujutsu kaisen zero and now we have the next one which is chainsaw man another new gen anime getting a movie obviously it is a trend since the mugen train got like really really high selling product that they got like surprisingly i mean, I mean like it's not really that surprising considering the fact that how popular demon slayer actually was and still i guess is it still popular anyways again let's talk about the actual topic right here chainsaw man raise arc movie will be a high selling movie in some way first of all let's take a look at the actual fan base itself it has already been like what two years since the release of chainsaw man season one fans has been waiting for such a long time and we finally got a movie obviously the fans will be swarming through the theaters to watch some crazy i mean the movie and considering the fact that how big the chainsaw man fan base actually is obviously i can't really compare it to like either jujutsu kaisen or demon slayer but it's still relatively big for such a high selling manga in japan and considering the fact that the, the amount of views that we actually saw on youtube is actually quite big as well for an anime movie teaser and it actually got like what 2.5 million views in just less than 24 hours man this is literally the turning point of chainsaw man this is where it actually starts since season one only has some few the, it's like the beginning of the beginning we are actually getting deep into the rabbit hole of chainsaw man and this is the start of it. So let's just hope this movie won't disappoint anyone, which obviously is going to be impossible to do. People will still get disappointed no matter whatever they do. They're going to look at this frame, they're going to go like, oh my god, the engine's missing a finger. It's bad, guys, it's bad. And it's funny how people will actually still complain about how accurate the art style is, or yada yada yada. Since we saw the trailer itself, it's pretty similar to Fujimoto's art style from the manga, which obviously is still just a pre-animated trailer we still can't judge anything based off that but it's a good first look at what it might actually going to be again we still have no idea who's the series director for chainsaw man movie so um well let's just say it's a 50 50 why obviously i'm not sure how good the production is for this movie but for a movie to get released they need to have a certain standard of how the 
movie actually will look like. They need to have the movie quality production. They need to have this standardized movie level animation for a movie to get released. Well, at least for anime. So obviously, it's not going to be hard for them to actually do this because, well, they kind of achieved that in the first season. <laughs> but let's see how it will actually turn out to be in the actual movie of Chainsaw Man. But yes, I am definitely looking forward to see this movie plays out in the theater. Hopefully, there's not much stuff going to get censored whatsoever because, man, there is a lot of stuff that needs to be censored. So if you're living in a country that pretty much censors most of the stuff, then oh well, I got news for you. I'm just going to say it's quite unfortunate. Well, to both of us, you and me, because I am living in a quite hard of censorship type of country, so yeah, they even censored out Aaron's Titan with a literal pants, bro. But yeah, those are pretty much it. I don't really think there's anything much to say about this particular movie because we only have one trailer out of it. So that is quite funny. That is quite... <laughs> but yeah, considering the fact that according to the leaks, quote-unquote leaks, um, the movie will get released somewhere around in fall of 2024, which is somewhere around October, November, and December of this year. So we have somewhere around seven months, seven, eight, nine months until the actual movie gets released. Obviously, these are just leaks. We don't even know what will happen. I'm quite positive by the fact that this movie will definitely going to be one of the biggest anime movie of this year because how hype it actually is. But yeah, let's just hope for the best. Let's just hope the production is going well right now. Let's just hope that the global release will be good as well because man, I can't wait five months until the movie get released here because I will see like tons of spoilers on Twitter already. <laughs> Those are pretty much it. Thank you very much for watching this video. I really hope you guys enjoyed. Please do check out probably pretentious and scene chief for their chainsaw man movie um videos as well because i am pretty much inspired by them to make this movie movie to make this video so yes thank you very much for watching this video i really hope you guys enjoyed don't forget to subscribe and like and i will see you guys in the next video goodbye If you ended up watching this part of video then hey welcome to the i want to watch until the end type of person J just kidding i'm actually just recording this so that i can reach eight minutes mark so um yeah this video i mean like this part of segment doesn't really have anything to do with the video i'm just adding this up just so it can actually reach this eight minutes i guess but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this part of the segment. I, to be honest, there's really nothing much to enjoy about this video. I mean, like this this part. Uh, you know what? Thank you.